scarce or rare. The availability of century-old art, and painted on canvas, is obviously limited. Anything painted today can become and feel a century old only in another 100 years from now. Based on the principles of scarcity and assured of constantly dwindling availability, a unique art installation is now being performed on the French Riviera for the first time. It all started on the Côte d'Ajou in the south of France a century ago. The area of the Provence and Alps Côte d'Ajou inspired most famous artists like Van Gogh. Renoy, Bonnard, Monet, Gauguin, Cézanne, Signac, and Modigliani to seek the unique light and the atmosphere that can only be found on the French Riviera. The sunlight and its intense colors, the azure blue waters of the Mediterranean, the Wedgwood blue skies, the emerald shade of its countryside, roofs of terracotta and ochre and fields of deep purple lavender of the south of France attracted Impressionist masters a century ago to travel the Provence, to live and work there permanently or just stay for a short time, but long enough to create a true masterpiece that inspires future generations. Today, and in this tradition, Impressionist art is still performed for selected art collectors and art investors buying into a century-old oil painting to own this once-in-a-lifetime art installation, commissioning to create a totally new masterpiece. The installation is performed on top of the century-old painting in museum quality. The aesthetically pleasing top layer will cover forever the 100-year-old original oil painting. But the ultimate disappearance of a genuine piece of art creates space for new art. The old oil painting will hide from all eyes forever and provides the foundation created long ago for the desired favorite French Impressionist performance. And painted as close to the original as can be, or as chosen by the collector or investor. The owner can be guided by his own imagination or inspired by what the master impressionist painter might have seen a hundred years ago when he made his first sketches and what was evolving under the intense sunlight causing a spectacular color scene, the feelings and what the artist captured or was influenced by. What did he see to the left or to the right? What happened a bit earlier or a bit later when he captured a scene? Ended it up to be only a sketch, or was it painted in oil on canvas after all? Did it get destroyed or simply has it never been discovered or made available to the art community, to collectors or the public? The art buyer can be the master of the scene, directing what should evolve during the process of this very personal art installation. It can emotionally link the owner to the most favorite artist and become even more personal when the desired impressionist is painted back into the owner's future to inspire and provide the beauty of the landscape with the incredible sunlight and the unique colors of the Côte d'Ajou evolving in the favorite scene as it was first imagined.